Hey guys, what's up? So in this video we are going to see a very useful uh, Linux terminal command which is which. Okay, so many a times, I mean when you use your terminal you use so many commands like in the previous video we were using man and the video before that um, we were using cat command. So you use these commands. In Unix world they are called the executables. They execute something. They do something for you. So you might be interested to know like where are they? Where are they located? Uh, which directory they are located? So one simple scenario you might be doing this like you might be interested into their location is when you install many versions of the same software maybe you have installed mysql and there are so many versions of mysql and you have installed all of them and suddenly you realize that when you write mysql dash u root dash p you are not using the correct version then you might be interested like okay whenever i write mysql where does it come from whether it comes from the right location or which version is it comes from so those are the situations when you will be interested to know like where are your executables located you want to track them in those scenarios that is one scenario there might be other scenarios also so we are going to look at which command which will give you the directory path of that command okay so first if you want to know about any command if you want to see the manual if you want to see the help you can always use man okay so this is the way you can see here how to use which what does which do how you can use which and what are these arguments stand I mean what do they do for you okay so this is the manual and we are going to quit from the manual and we are just going to use which command with other Linux executables so let's use which with cat so bin cat so your cat executable is in bin okay now let's see where is man so man is inside user bin man okay let's see where is which itself so this is also in user which which so which is very useful let's see where is mysql mysql is in user local bin mysql let's see where is postgresql okay so this is a very long path for postgresql let's see where is ruby so this is the ruby command okay so this is the way you do these things so this is the way you use which command it is a very useful command and you can use it in some scenarios when you are interested in locating your executables so that was all for this video see you guys in the next video thanks